you are looking for some cheap Forza Horizon 4 credits, then check out 5mmo.com. I'll leave a link down below to their site in the description. You can get 10 million credits for less than £10. Use discount code HYRAX at checkout for 5% off. Yo, guys, welcome back to another video. I'm in this Kia Stinger, completely stock. I don't think this car will have anything to do with the video. It's just a car I'm in when I loaded up the game. But the other day, a uh, pretty big update dropped for Forza Horizon 4. We've now got Root Creator. That's pretty cool. We're going to check that out right now. I, I don't know how you get into this root creator. I honestly don't. I maybe should have researched it before checking this video, but you know, I just didn't. I'm winging it, guys. So I think what we're going to have to do is... I just don't know. But hold on there, guys. We're just going to do a wheel spin. Just noticed I had a wheel spin, so what we're going to get... I need the dab emote. I still haven't got it. I need it. I don't know how I've not got it. And what am I getting? <laughs> Satin trousers. Do I even care? No, probably not, but I'm never going to wear them. But anyway, let's find this root creator. Don't know where it is. Approximately 10 hours later. Okay, guys, so I finally managed to figure out how you actually get to the root creator. Pretty much what you do is you can start it from any race event. So, for example, I'm just going to go to this one. I'm going to have to drive there, but... Shout out to Wadey, he's a YouTuber, he makes Forza videos, uh, I watched his video because he did a video on the Root Creator, so that's how I found out, so yeah, I'll leave a link down below to his channel, go and subscribe I guess. But anyway, I'll catch you guys when I'm at the event and ready to start a room or whatever it's called. Okay, so I'm at the Derwent Lakeside Sprint, so yeah, here we go, create room, that's what we want. Now, yeah, I'm going to pick a car. I don't want the Kia Stinger, actually. What I'm going to go with is V. I'm going to go with the Audi R8 V10 Plus. I never really drive it. I didn't really drive it on Horizon 3. I've only driven a little bit in Horizon 4, so we might as well give it a go and see what it's really like. So, yeah, gives us a reason to use a car, I guess. Okay, so I think we literally drive to draw a route. Now, that actually sounds really cool. Checkpoint at any time by pressing the so checkpoint that place button. is a checkpoint, yep, yeah, boom, that'll do. I don't want to move a checkpoint, we'll confirm that right now. If you rewind, you lose any checkpoints you pass. Right, so if I rewind, I don't have a checkpoint. So I can literally go over here, I'm guessing. I can as well. Drive Roots back to the start gantry to create a circuit. To point. Okay, point to point, I get this. The menu and select place finish light. I get this. This route, is easy you have now. To drive back through the start light, obviously. Very easy. So I'm literally gonna cre create a square probably. Oh, I know. We can do some turns. I haven't been putting any checkpoints, have I? Yep, that'll do. Oh no, no, I didn't do the right thing. Boom! There we go. Create a little circle, get a circle going on. Yep, there we go. And boom, yep, there we go, again. Got another checkpoint. This is actually, this is a, this is a great thing, this. Yo, we need to create like a Hyrax HD. Um, just the word Hyrax HD circuit. That'd be quite... Them. May give that a go for another video. I don't know. Then ba -doom, ba -doom, place one there. See, the trick is to get these checkpoints in the right place, so you can't do any cutting corners. That's the trick, I think. Oh, place one right there. So you've got to go in a bit of water now. Then put one right there. Have a chance of hitting the tree. I'm gonna go right. Past like the finishing start line. Now create a circuit, which is what we want. We've hit a tree. Oh, that that's gonna be a tricky one. Gonna be tricky that. Boom! Right there. Now I need to test drive it. So yes, let's test drive this route and see if I can even race my own route. But we're gonna share this, so feel free to have a go at this. My gamer tag is criminal pig. 3506 go and um, do all that good stuff so you can race this here we go I wonder how the uh, driver tars cope with it actually that'll be quite interesting to see how the driver tars actually cope well it's telling me to break yeah you see it's telling me to break way too early I should have put one here shouldn't I a checkpoint here but 
would have been a good idea. Are these going to hit trees now? Oh, I'm going to hit a tree in a minute. Yep. Yep, there you go. That's causing chaos. It's me and Easy Dan Cover and he's in the air. All right, racing club. Uh, where? What? How have I missed a checkpoint? I'm, I'm rewinding. I'm confused. Oh, there's a checkpoint there. Yeah, you, you can't see that, can you? You can't see that through all the uh, trees and the hedges. It's hidden by like a dip, hidden dip. Um, it just did disappear. Going through here, I think. There wasn't actually a checkpoint there. All the driver tours are cheating. Like, oh, they're all getting confused. This is just a mess. The drive, he, he missed a checkpoint there. He did. So is he. He's hit a tree. I'm currently first. I'm not surprised. It's a tricky event. This. Got to avoid the trees as well. Maybe R8 wasn't the best choice. I've missed a checkpoint. All right. Checkpoint is there. We'll have to make sure we don't miss that. You see, I was just heading over there, I think. And boom, there's a checkpoint here. It's not, it's not a bad little route, this. If you're in something off roady maybe. That'll be quite good. But boom, that's going to be quite tricky. There's a rock there as well. That's actually a well-placed checkpoint, I think. Kind of did learn a bit here to place the checkpoints. And then got one all the way up here. Pitching straight line. Now, here we go. This is going to be... Driver Tars will fail here. Bet you. Should we just wait for them? We'll just wait for these Driver Tars. Oh no, he's, he's got it, he's got it. I want to come first at my own event. Boom. Oh, he's going off-road. Yep, yep, he's climbing the mountain. They're all climbing. How many that was checkpoint missed? As if. Now it's good to take eight. I've respawned up here, I'm eight. Boom, through that checkpoint. Through that checkpoint. But I'm sure that's what I did. I'm sure it is. Alright, we're going to save that. My first route. It looks so basic on there. It honestly looks so basic. Uh, I'm going to name it first, first route. Like that. Then save that. And then I think we're going to have the option to share it. What should I do? Uh, create custom event. Is that what I want to press? I don't know. Right, I'm going to start it, the race again. This is going to be interesting. Let's see if I know where any of the checkpoints are, basically. Let's go. Give it a go. See what it's like. See what it is like, indeed. Yep, so there's no checkpoint here. I should, well should have put one. Because you can literally just go straight across. And boom. We're here like that. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. I know I've missed a checkpoint here, haven't I? Oh, here we go, here we go. These are the first checkpoints. Um, I haven't missed one though. Mm. I don't know where all them are going like. Yeah, they get reset, them driver tars. I think that's a new feature in Force Rising 4. If dri driver tars miss a checkpoint. They get reset, which is good, because I've always thought, you've always seen cheating and stuff. Almost crashing into the water. Where's this next checkpoint? No, I thought one was there then, does it? What? I've missed. No, I haven't. I haven't missed. Oh, yeah, I have. i just seen it then. I did miss a checkpoint. Why? I fell a few places. That is not good at all. Oh, oh, that, yes, that jump has caught me out. Um, reverse, maybe. Oh, I've been hit by the focus. This focus is there. Uh, focus, uh, focus RS life. Oh. oh, no, through the trees. And I've missed the checkpoint. Going to have to rewind a little bit, I think. Rewind a little bit more, you know. Kind of, um, not doing very well here, oh, am I? Oh, this is a bit bumpy. Um, yeah. <laughs> oh, we're all stuck. Now there's five of us stuck. Go on, let me go, let me go. Come on, the R8 can beat the TT, definitely. I don't know where I'm going. I I've missed. 
the TT is actually beating the Ori. Not for long, not for long. Not for long. Yes, come on, we're coming in fourth. I'll take that. No podium position. But never mind. That is actually a challenging circuit. It's also a frustrating circuit at that as well. Level 45. It's not too bad. How much am I getting? 7k for that? Is that it? Is um, Root Creator Rewards just OP or something now? 7k for like a few minutes work. Oh, so close to level 46. That's a bit too mad, that. So guys, thank you very much for watching this video. This was just me testing out Root Creator that came in the new Forza Horizon 4 update like a few days ago. First time trying out Root Creator. I think it's, it's a very good thing. I'm glad I can create my own races now. Like where to go because we can make some seriously cool stuff with this. And I've seen like some really cool races so far that people have posted on Twitter. So yeah. I can't wait to try out other people's as well. I think this may become a video series. Trying out other people's races. I think that'll be fun. But thank you very much for watching this video guys. Leave a like if you did enjoy. Subscribe if you want to around here. But until next time guys. Peace out. You know when you just get the video created? But I already know I'ma get it now though. I'ma get it.